you watch football teams, right? And they go and watch the tape of that football game and they try to see what they did right, what they did wrong. I do that with screencast and you should be too. Shooting the screencast, right? So shooting that screencast, and I want you guys to understand that we have to perfect each and every one of these, each and every one of these steps. It's not just getting in here and getting a yes to a screencast and, and, and shooting the screencast and et cetera, going on and down. No, you're gonna fumble, you're gonna fail. It's gonna happen. I promise you, it happened to me. Okay, failure is a part of the process. So get ready for it. It's coming. And so it's all about how fast you want to stand stand up. It's going to show you how fast you're going to move forward again, okay? So back to the screencast. You're going to shoot a screencast, right? Um, and, and when we shoot that screencast, guys, some of you are getting into 11, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, and you're getting too fucking technical. Knock it off. Stick to the script. Bring, bring excitement. Bring value. Educate. That's what we're there for. Put it in their face that you know what you're doing. And this screencast is our first positioning. They don't know us by getting off the cold call. They don't know us by a Facebook group post. They don't know us. So the first impression you're going to give is your screencast. You need to perfect that. We need to make sure we're bringing value, value, value by educating the customer at their level, not our level. They don't know what a backlink is. Explain it to them, right? So we're going to be the educational factor when it comes to lead generation. We're going to let them know what we can do. So even if they don't pull the trigger with you right now, and this is going to happen, guys, this cycle happens. Some of them will not pull the trigger today. Some of them you won't even be able to get a hold of sometimes for 90 days. But we have people reaching back out to us two years later going, thank God your YouTube video is still up so we could find you and they hire us, okay? So this is a rotation. This is a freaking, this is running pay dirt. This pay dirt is still coming back and paying me to this day. It's nuts, it's crazy, and it works. Trust the process, okay? Um, so screencast, we're gonna perfect that. We're gonna excite, we're gonna do a good first impression. And, and I do suggest for you newer people, don't put your face on the video. Take your face off the video, just record the screen so you can talk and feel good and not have to worry about what you look like, okay? So maybe the first 20 or 30 you shoot, let's do it without our face on it. Let's get really comfortable with what's being said. Let's start to be able to do that. And then once you're good, then you can start putting your face in. Then you can start integrating. Maybe if you don't want to put your face in it, take a picture shot and put it at the bottom of the video, okay? Um, you can do that so they can still see your face down here, but it's just a picture. And then you're not worried about it. It's a voiceover at that point, right? So there's lots of ways that you can go and get good. Lots of little tips and tricks in the screencast that you can do to really make this perfect, okay? Because that perfecting your screencast it is, is seriously the difference of getting somebody to say yes now or getting them to, to wait a couple years to get back to you. Some of those ones that waited a couple years, those are the ones I flunked at, right? But some of the ones I completely blew them away that pull the trigger right now, those are the ones I did correctly. So I try to study the ones that pull the trigger and what did I do to, 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 to really bring that excitement, to really educate, and I try to go back. It's almost like you watch football teams, right? And they go and watch the tape of that football game and they try to see what they did right what they did wrong i do that with screencast and you should be too each and every one of these are recorded for a reason not just for them to watch it but for you to perfect it for you to watch it to see what you did right so that you can make it better and better and better right we want to we once we have something that works we want to continue on that path um so shooting your screencast and perfecting your screencast doing your outreach and perfecting your outreach. Maybe you're doing email to screencast. There's ways to perfect that to get a better turnover rate on that, right? There's ways to perfect your cold call. Maybe when you do your cold call, they're just saying shut up and here's the email, but then you're noticing they're not opening your screencast. Maybe we need to go a little deeper on our cold call, ask them more questions, make them kind of qualify that they're going to watch the video. Hey.